everyone and what Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel XOXL. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below for more videos like this at least once a week. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Rochelle underscore XOX, and on Twitter, which is XOX underscore Shell. Woo! So, this video, like my many other videos, is going to be an Ipsy unbagging. If you have not checked them out before, definitely check them out. I will link them up here. Also, check out my Boxy Charms unboxing playlists as well. And we're going to get right into this video. actually mourning my ipsy bag I am um I'll tell you why so as I was going through it I realized that I counted all the products and there was only four so I am actually missing a brush which is unfortunate um but yeah then after I've been doing the boxy charm unboxings I've realized that these feel very like not to say cheap, but kind of cheap. And I'm just being honest on like how I feel. I know that this is only $10 a month. I know that they're only samples, but compared to the BoxyCharm one, which is like $10 more with your full-size products, I just feel like this is a little bit not as good of a deal. But that's just me personally. Let me know what you get in your Ipsy bags and what you like better if you like BoxyCharm or Ipsy because I can fit all these in my one hand. So we're going to get right into it. We're going to start with the my favorite with my least favorite no my least favorite to my favorite <laughs> so we're gonna start with the Tony Moly the black tea London classic serum Tony Moly is a really good brand this is the black tea serum which is a skincare product which I love skincare um I think that this is good it's an anti-aging anti-aging high quality black tea so this is pretty cool. Tony Moly has really cute packaging. He has like little panda packaging and stuff like that. But this is just a sample size and it's fine. <laughs> then this is Harkari Haikari Cream Pigment in Fierce. They are cruelty free. But this packaging is a no go for me. No go. I can't even open it. Oh my I literally can't even open this. Like, I'm literally about to give up. What is this? Oh, it's a very pretty color, I must say. Very pretty. I feel like this is a dupe of, like, an Urban Decay color. Um, or a Kat Von D color. Um, it smells very makeup-y. I noticed that right when I opened the packaging. Um, don't like this packaging whatsoever, but okay. Then we would have a little pink brush that I would show you, but I didn't get that, so we're not going to even go there. This is the Ciate London Glow 2 Highlighter Illuminating Powder, which feels like there's absolutely nothing in here. So that's nice, too. Again, with the plastic little packaging that I'm not going to be able to open. It's actually a very, very pretty color. It's called Moon Dust. Very pretty color, I must say. Like this swatches very well. You could even use it as an eyeshadow if you wanted to. Um, CH London does have very good products. They're the ones that have the lip flip lipstick, which the glitter flip. So you put it on and then it becomes glitter after you flip your lips, which I think is pretty cool. Then we have this teeny tiny little mascara tube. Like seriously? It is the MAC False Lashes Extreme Black. I did save this as my favorite, though, because it is MAC. And I do like the brand MAC, so that is the only reason why it got first place. But it's also teensy tiny. I understand that it's just a sample box. I get that. But look at how small this is. It's almost like a 100, po 100 point perk from Sephora. Like, that's how teeny tiny this thing is. It's adorable, and it's cute for travel, but I also feel like some travel size mascaras are bigger than this. So let's check out this brush. I also do like the tube, because it's... That brush is pretty nice, you could say. How many uses are you going to get out of it? Not many. <laughs> so, honestly, this August 2018 box was a big thumbs down from me, personally. Let me know what you thought of your Ipsy bag. Um, maybe I just need to customize it more, but I am in mourning for this. <laughs> yep, 
Yes. I might not get this anymore, but we'll see. Um, give me your feedback and let me know about other subscription boxes that you have used that maybe I will try out as well. So definitely let me know about that down in the comments. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye, guys!